STS-94 was a mission of the United States Space Shuttle Columbia, launched on 1 July 1997. Topic. True Topic. Mission highlights This was a reflight of the STS-83 Microgravity Science Laboratory MSL mission. MSL was originally launched on 4 April 1997 at 2.20 p.m. Time and was intended to be on orbit for 15 days, 16 hours. The mission was cut short due to a problem with fuel cell number 2 and Columbia landed on 8 April 1997 after 3 days 23 hours. The primary payload on STS-83 was the Microgravity Science Laboratory MSL. MSL was a collection of microgravity experiments housed inside a European Space Lab Long Module LM. It built on the cooperative and scientific foundation of the International Microgravity Laboratory Missions IML-1 on STS-42 and IML-2 on STS-65, the United States Microgravity Laboratory Missions USML-1 on STS-50 and USML-2 on STS-73, the Japanese Spacelab Mission Spacelab J on STS-47, the Spacelab Life and Microgravity Science Mission LMS on STS STS-78, and the German Spacelab missions, D-1 on STS-61A and D-2 on STS-55. MSL featured 19 materials science investigations in four major facilities. These facilities were the large isothermal furnace, the expedite the processing of experiments to the space station express rack, the electromagnetic containerless processing facility Tempus, and the coarsening in solid liquid mixtures CSLM facility, the droplet combustion experiment DCE, and the combustion module 1 facility. Additional technology experiments were to be performed in the Mitic Glovebox MGBX, developed by the Marshall Space Flight Center MSFC, and the high-packed digital television high -pack DTV, system was used to provide multi-channel real-time analog science video. The large isothermal furnace was developed by the Japanese Space Agency NASDA, for the STS-47 Spacelab J mission and was also flown on STS-65 IML-2 mission. It housed the measurement of diffusion coefficient by shear cell method experiment, the diffusion of liquid metals and alloys experiment, the diffusion in liquid lead tin telluride experiment, the impurity diffusion in ionic melts experiment, the liquid phase sintering 2 experiment leaf, and the diffusion processes in molten semiconductors experiment DPIMS. The Combustion Module 1 CM1, facility from the NASA Lewis Research Center housed experiments on laminar soot processes experiment and the structure of flame balls at low Lewis number experiment SOFBALL. The Droplet Combustion Experiment DCE, is designed to investigate the fundamental combustion aspects of single, isolated droplets under different pressures and ambient oxygen concentrations for a range of droplet sizes varying between 2 mm in, and 5 mm in. The DCE apparatus is integrated into a single-width MSL Spacelab rack in the cargo bay. The express rack replaces a Spacelab double rack and special hardware will provide the same structural and resource connections the rack will have on the space station. It will house the physics of hard spheres phase experiment and the Astro PGBA experiment. The Electromagnetic Containerless Processing Facility Tempus, is used for the experiments on nucleation in different flow regimes, thermophysical properties of advanced materials in the undercooled liquid state experiment, measurements of the surface tension of liquid and undercooled metallic alloys by oscillating drop technique experiment, alloy undercooling experiments, the study of the morphological stability of growing dendrites by comparative dendrite velocity measurements on pure knee and dilute knee C alloy 
alloy in the Earth and Space Laboratory experiment, the undercooled melts of alloys with polytetrahedral short-range order experiment, the thermal expansion of glass-forming metallic alloys in the undercooled state experiment, the AC calorimetry and thermophysical properties of bulk glass-forming metallic liquids experiment and the measurement of surface tension and viscosity of undercooled liquid metals experiment. There were also experiments on measuring microgravity. They included the Space Acceleration Measurement System SAMS, the Microgravity Measurement Assembly MMA, the Quasi-Steady Acceleration Measurement System and the Orbital Acceleration Research Experiment OARE. The Mitic Glovebox MGBX facility supported the Bubble and Drop Nonlinear Dynamics BDND experiment, the study of the fundamental operation of a capillary-driven heat transfer CHT device in microgravity experiment, the internal flows in a free drop IFFD experiment and the fiber-supported droplet combustion experiment FSDC2. Topic. See also List of human spaceflights List of space shuttle missions Outline of space science Topic. External links NASA Mission Summary STS-94 video highlights this article incorporates public domain material from websites or documents of the National Aeronautics and Space Administration.